Hey guys, it's Andre or Angeling, whichever you prefer. And it's Saturday. It's time to party and dance. Earlier when I auditioned, I said I was gender queer. I am planning to get a sex change. You know, when I have the cash. Now I said I'm a female. There's nothing wrong with that, in my opinion. So whatever pronouns you would like to use, you can use male or female. I like music. And I suck at dancing. As you guys already saw. And I'll be 20 in June. I think I might be the oldest in this whole class. I'm currently a sophomore at Western Michigan University. I am studying film. I like to play games. You know, when I have time, I love Disney Channel. I'm sitting straight up. I know I'm grown and everything, but you know, you never grow too old from Disney Channel. I love cartoons. I'm a kid at heart. I'm an addiction to Tumblr. I think a lot of people do, but that's fine. I love sushi. I really do. I love sushi. My favorite is spicy tuna roll, and I love boba tea. I would say my favorite is honeydew and then taro. And I love Thai tea. Not like the bubble Thai tea, but just regular Thai tea. My coming out story. I didn't really come out. It just happened. Like, okay, I was in eighth grade. And there was going around that, you know, I had sexual dreams of this girl. Girls, I think. It was a girl. I don't know. Um, it was, first I was just joking around with people. And then I guess someone took it serious. And it just spread it. And at first I thought it was hilarious. And then I guess it didn't turn out hilarious. I didn't really know what gay was. I didn't even know there was such a thing. I remember I said, oh, the girl's hot. But I said everything was hot. I'd be like, oh, that pencil's hot. You know, I was just being retarded and silly. And then, so, and then I found out there was such a thing where people actually can like the same sex. And I thought about it. And I was like, you know what? Everyone thinks I'm gay already. And plus, I thought about it. I'm like, I'd never had a crush on a guy at all. I just either just dated them or just said I had one. Just because everyone else did. So I was just trying to fit in. Finally, with my family, <clears throat> my ex girlfriend, well, during the time we were dating, she sent a letter to me. I think I was in year nine. But yeah, anyways, she sent a letter to me. And it was a love letter. And I have no privacy at my home. I'm going to just say this straight up. And my mom opened it. And yeah, she was questioning about it, she was asking me, and she was yelling at me, and blah, 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 and I was like, yeah, that's my girlfriend, and yeah, and then that's how it really happened, and everyone, uh, everyone just basically knew I was gay, kind of, in my family, or if I had them, yeah, my mom told everyone on her side of the family, even though it wasn't her to tell, but, you know, it was her choice, I can't tell her what she can do and what she cannot, um, that's all really for my coming out story.